Hello world people of the YouTube, welcome to another episode of Super Smash Bros. Duda. I didn't go to E3, sadly, didn't go to Nintendo World. Well, I couldn't because I don't know where Nintendo World is. Couldn't record at Best Buy even though I did go and I bailed out. I was pretty sad about that. I should have went there earlier. I was like, no. So yeah, so today, I'm, well, you know, I didn't watch the entire, you know, E3 Treehouse Live at E3 thing I'm a dirt, but, you know, they took a, you know, I was, there was a bunch of games I didn't even care about, and I was trying to get to the good stuff, like, you know, Smash Brothers or a Mario Party. Yeah, they have a new Mario Party, new Mario vs. Donkey Kong, and yeah, they focus too much on Splatoon, I mean, nobody even, I don't know, I mean, even the people from the treehouse, and they're supposed to be excited for, you know, their their company's games, but no, they were all excited about Splatoon. They did three videos in Splatoon, eh? I don't know, I'm, I'm not gonna get Splatoon, it doesn't not interest me. And they only did two Smash videos, one Mario Party, one Treasure Tracker, two Yoshi's Woolly's World, and I don't think they did any Mario vs. Donkey Kong. So, if you want to see this, um, leak, is isn't really a leak, it's like, no, you, well, you have to hear it to believe it. So, I mean, they just, you know, how I speculated that there, there could be a new character, and, you know, they gave us a hinty hint, which, you know, and, um, so if you want to know where, um, which video I'm at, it's the, um, Day 2 Smash Brothers, and if you go to 10 minutes, you can hear it. So, let's get started. Listen very closely. Now, these, these rosters are so huge that spending the amount of time to, to really get into why you love a particular character and why it works for you is really, really good. Well, and, and Nate, you're a huge advocate of, of random. You think that's a, a like, that's kind of one of those, uh, you know, glorious ways for you to play? Because, yeah. I mean, it shows off your skill in, in all these characters, but, you know, who have you been leaning towards? Uh, in this build, I've been leaning towards Link. I'll play a little Samus later. I, Samus is actually just seems pretty big, pretty big bumps in this yeah. game. Um, well, you know I'm a big Samus player. I love Samus. I've actually been leaning towards a couple characters that we haven't announced yet, so... They just said it right there. Leaning towards a couple of new characters. Now, when people say couple, um, they usually mean, like, dosos, or one, or two, just two. Yeah. So, you know, since they were talking about Link and Samus, you know, so characters that haven't been announced yet. So for Link and his series, I speculate it's either Gandorf or Gearham. No, not Ham you find at the store. That, that, that weird bad guy from the Zelda series. Don't know who the heck he is. Don't know what he would do. But he looks pretty cool. He wanted to be in the game. And Gandorf, you know, he probably... May Maybe he could turn, since there was, he was talking about Link and stuff like that, so... Graham and the Link. Now, since he was also talking about, like, Samus, too, since he was leaning towards, um, the character, so, um... This gives us a chance of getting our Wrigley. I mean, I, I wouldn't think of any other Metroid characters that would join the roster, I mean... Instead of, you know, making it Metroid at least, I mean, just make it make better at least for the boss. I mean, that'd be... And then Ridley could be the uh, new character. That'd be great. So, okay, let's watch this again. To really get into why you love a particular character and why it works for you, it's really, really good. Well, and, and Nate, you're a huge advocate of, of random. You think that's a, a that's kind of one of those uh, you know glorious ways for you to play because yeah. I mean it shows off your skill in, in all these characters. But you know who have you been leaning towards lately? Uh, in this build, I've been leaning towards Link. I'll play a little Samus later. I, Samus is actually just seems pretty big, pretty big bumps in yeah. this game. Um, well, you know I'm a big Samus player. I love Samus. I've actually been leaning towards a couple characters that we haven't announced yet. So I'm not going to talk about those. See? You notice how he said boss? You know, I mean pretty big boss. Maybe he said it on purpose, because, you know, Ridley's a boss, and a lot of 
Metroid games. We went to like every single one as far as I know, so. Yeah, Ripley could be joining the battle. Really hope so. Don't know who any other people from the Metroid series don't. All I know is Mother Brain, Samus, and Ripley. It's the only three characters I know. So I don't think you'll find us anywhere else on the internet. I hope so, because, you know, I, I don't know. I mean, I found it first, so haha. -ha, to all the other people who didn't find it first. So thank you for watching. Watch our other Smash Duda Bender. Yep, they have. Yep, and here's a sneak peek of the um, character selection and the some of the stages and the stage selection thingy. So, you know. Yep, uh, yeah, it was great. They focused too much on Splatoon. Like, you know, they should have, like, did a, a ton of Smash Brothers, but, you know. They should have done a Treehouse for Nintendo 3DS because there's Smash Bros. and all that good do that landy stuff. So. Goodbye. And wait, why, why, why isn't this video stopping? Oh, I forgot to say the magic word. Please, do that. Yes, that's do that. Do that.